Yeah. Call the meeting to order. Thank you all for coming. Are we good with the... Uh, Good evening all. This is a public hearing into the bylaws that will be introduced to you in a moment by the Deputy City Clerk. Uh, Council for the City of Coquitlam has given first reading to these bylaws and has directed that we hold a public hearing to get uh, views of the public. The floor will be opened to uh, speakers, starting with those that have pre-registered, which is a grand total of, I don't think, anybody? Nobody? No. Um, uh, so we'll open, uh, after we introduce the bylaws, after staff do, uh, we'll open the floor to any of the might want to make their views known. Council members are here with open minds and are here to listen to your input. No one has prejudged these applications, uh, but it's not a question and answer period, and so we're going to ask you not to debate the merits of the proposed bylaw with either council members, with staff, or with those in the audience who might be opposed to your point of view, that you restrict your comments to the proposed bylaw on the floor at the time, that you be as brief and concise as possible, um, and that you be respectful in your submission and not make personal comments. Uh, I'll ask that the uh, audience be respectful of each speaker and allow that speaker to make his or her point without interruption and that you refrain from clapping, booing, cheering, uh, or any other outbursts related to any application, any of the speakers tonight. Uh, as chair of the meeting, I'll reserve the right to conclude any presentation that doesn't relate to the bylaw that becomes abusive or that becomes repetitive of views that the speaker has already made known uh, to council members. <laughs> Please note, if you wish to provide a written submission to an item, you must submit it to the Deputy City Clerk prior to the adjournment of the uh, public hearing related to that item. That means after the first item, you must hand in your written submissions prior to us adjourning that item. Uh, council can't receive any additional information after a public hearing has been adjourned on an item. So uh, immediately following the adjournment of the public hearing tonight, after we've dealt with everything, a regular council meeting may be convened in order that council, or will be convened in order that council can give consideration to items on the, the agenda uh, of the public hearing. However, if during the public hearing an item uh, still requires some questions to be answered, uh, we may uh, defer uh, consideration of that item. I'd also like to note at this time that item two, which is an application to change the land use de designation for 3390 Galloway Avenue, is being removed from tonight's public hearing agenda as the applicant has requested that their application be withdrawn. I'll now call on Ms. Lohr to introduce the other bylaws. That's, uh, we're skipping number two. We'll start with number one then, uh, Ms. Lohr. Item number one relates to bylaw numbers 4072 and 4074, 2009 at 43407 Galloway Avenue. Good evening, Your Worship and members of Council. This application for an official community plan amendment and rezoning for a site lo is located on the north side of Galloway Avenue, just east of Coast Meridian. The applicant is proposing to redesignate a small portion of the site from large village single family to street oriented village home and rezone the site, the same area from RS8 large village single family to RTM1 street oriented village, street oriented village home residential. The shift will increase the area designated for street oriented village home by approximately 950 square meters. This shift is necessitated as a result of further detailed site design on the street-oriented village home site, which will utilize an internal road system rather than a public lane to the north of the site. Given the minor nature of this OCP and zoning designation change, staff are recommending council give second, third, and fourth reading to bylaw numbers 4072 and 4074. Thank you. Okay small piece of land here. Are there any uh, speakers to this item? Second time, are there any speakers to this item? Third and final time, are there any speakers to this item? This item will be adjourned in a second, please. Seeing none, this item is adjourned. Uh, we'll skip item number two. We'll go to item number three. Item number three relates to bylaw number 4067-2009 for 1385 Coast Meridian.
Uh, your Worship, as indicated on the overhead, uh, the subject property is located on the east side of Coast Meridian Road at Queenston Avenue. The property total is 0.4 of a hectare, or one acre in size. It's presently zoned RS2, one family suburban residential. The site is designated small village, single family residential in the Smiling Creek neighborhood plan. Properties to the north, south, and east are zoned RS2, one family suburban residential. Properties to the west are zoned RS7, small village, single family residential, and RS8, large village, single family residential. The site currently accommodates a single family dwelling. And the proposed rezoning to RS7, small village, single family residential, is consistent with the neighborhood plan and will facilitate the development of approximately five single family and two two family residential lots. Okay. Are there any speakers to this item? Second time, are there any speakers to this item? Third and final time, are there any speakers to this item? Seeing none, I declare this item and the public hearing adjourned. Okay.